Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Bonavetta Berlin, the coffee machine that will revolutionize the entire industry. With a simple scan, you will have freshly roasted coffee within a matter of five minutes. Or was it, was it two? Well, well, with the incorporated internet connectivity and a camera, you can even display the hottest stock market trends if you want. So, let's check it out. This is not working, I told you, what are we doing here? No. We cannot have an actor, he doesn't even know how to use the machine. I know. We still need to tell people we're gonna fulfill machines to backers this year, we're gonna do the investment round, and we've got brand new machines coming over and we need to tell that to people, we need to relay the message. And even more, we need to be able to tell everyone that we're gonna change the industry for the better and we need to let them know how we're gonna do it. Yeah. I mean, direct trade isn't even growing fast enough yet. Come on, Pete, yeah, help us, help out, us man. out, dude. Yeah, but direct trade is not nearly enough. We want to enable farmers to become entrepreneurs. They are already convinced about the product and the quality they are producing, but we just want to help them get out there. Using technology and becoming data-centric is the best way for them to grow their business. That's a good point. Exactly. A lot of people in the coffee industry are doing great things, but in order to really make a difference, we need to be scalable. We already have the passion and with a lot of thorough work we can become big enough to really make the change that the coffee industry needs. But what about the bigger topics like climate change? Yes, climate change and coffee industry, they do affect each other. We need innovation to overcome the threat. So we hear buzzwords like data science, cryptocurrencies and blockchain. Although they can help us move beyond the current status, so what matters most is to have them implemented to add a value. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry, sorry, sorry. So we've got climate change and we have innovation, but how are you engaging your customers? Listen, customers nowadays, they don't want to be just customers anymore. They want to be activists. They want to go beyond consumption. They need to be part of a journey. Where products come from? Where are they going? Where are we at? And in this journey, we create meaning. We understand who we are as well. We have to go beyond ironic consumption. The things that we don't believe in, but you know, it's just what it is. We can go beyond that. We can create meaning. Consumption is one of the most powerful tools in a globalized society. So what is the big picture? I mean, why are we really here? So why are we here today? We could be all sitting in the sun somewhere nice, but we want to build a legacy. And I can tell you, we will. Because we've tried so hard and it was challenging, but we've overcome the challenges and built a fantastic product. We've had friends, family, wife, three kids, a team of 17. And I can tell you, this product is gonna change an entire industry. The second largest industry, in fact. And it will do so with a big gun.